Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah again I'm very very sorry for that cut it was due to a bad network and we are saying um, good afternoon to every Gambian that's watching and it's the Sundang family like I said earlier on the family of Solo Sundang the opposition activist who was arrested and tortured to death by the Gambian government um, we are currently in exile and like everybody knows but we are here today um, on a live stream to appeal to all Gambian electorates. You're in the Gambia or not, but you're a Gambian who's concerned about the future of Gambians. We, we just want to appeal to you to vote for the opposition coalition that has been set up not long ago, which made us very proud as Gambians. And personally, as a young Gambian, I, I am grateful that the opposition leaders in the Gambia know and recognize the need for a coalition to help us regain our country back, which we have lost, and everybody knows that. The Gambia is um, its not the Gambia that we knew before. It's not the Gambia that our parents wanted us to have, and it's not the Gambia that I want my children to have. And I know like that um, a lot of Gambians, home and abroad, don't even recognize the Gambia anymore. This is not what we know, this is not what we knew, and it used to be a peaceful country, a country that there used not to exist torture, disappearances, not even a word you can say freely. You cannot even express what you feel or what you want. And we say we have democracy, but then no, we don't. And I don't really have to say much because we all know what is really going on in the Gambia right now, but all we have to do and the part we have to play as Gambians and personally as a family of Solo Sandling is to appeal to everyone to make you know that we would be grateful even though we are disfranchised uh, disenfranchised from um, voting because we are outside and we are not accepted to vote for Gambia even though we are Gambians but for you people who are there we rely on you we want you to vote for your future, for our future and for the future of our children. We want to have the Gambia that we knew back in our hands. And therefore, we want you all, be it the new voters, be it the, 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 our mothers, our aunties, our uncles, our sisters and our brothers. Please vote for Adam Abaro, who the uh, opposition leaders have come together and chosen rightfully elected rightfully to represent us in the coming election come December 1st. We want to be part of the change that we've all been yearning for. We want to be on the right side of history, on the positive side. And we don't want to sit and hear our children ask us, what well, have you done for the Gambia when it was going through those difficult times? Personally, I believe my father has done his part. Usain Ndabo and the rest of the prisoners the political prisoners have done their part. They have done all they could, all they owed the Gambia. But then, what have we done? If we cannot say anything, the vote that we have is ours. What we have to do is go to the polls on December 1st, vote Adam Abaro legally, and we know we would make a change if the elections go free and fair. But let's hope that the best happen. Let's just hope that what we all want takes place. And some of you, all of you, you are digglu. We know what we want. We know the family solo sending. We are hamne. We want Gambia. We have come to like that. We for Gambia. Amar freedom. We are hamne. We want to know. We are yalla. We have government bitiye ko tocho for Gambia. We are gain us in dikad. We are lulu tahud ba. I have warna passé fum nek ni dañ wara def li nga xamné mo ñu war ñu nak mënu ñu vote waye fok nañ né ñu nit euh liñ mëna def rek moy wax ak ñi nga xamné ño fa nek mëna vote ñu dem December 1st ci election ci 
ñu vot adama borom nga xamné opposition parties yi yépp ak leaders yi ñom mom lañ tok ñu elect yaakar ko gëm né mom mën nañuy sauver ci liñ nekk ni ndax gambia bi nga xamné mom lañ xamone du gambia bi nga xamné mom lañ nekk tay gambia bi ñu nekk tay moy gambia bo xamné kenn mënta tok nga wax lu la neex kenn mënta tok nga wax li nga xamné moy dégga ben nit né la jaarama jërëjëf so waxé nañ lay tiyé ñu tejj la ñom aussi ñu daal ngeen ci prison bi té def fuñ dara li nga xamné ñaaw na ndax solo sa nek mi nga xamné mom lañ doon wax ñu jox ñu niwam wala ñu won ñu ndax déna wala déwut té fu doon dara lu ñaaw ndax constitution gambia bi moko téggé won né so amé lu la naxalé mu nga gëna ñaxtu ko té bul bul am lén li nga xamné mu nga ko gagné nit bul def dara li nga xamné mu nga ko toraxalé nit té fu naané april 14 suma papa ak ñepp ñu nekkon ci ci protest bi kërëm def ñu dara lu ñaaw ak li nga xamné waron nañ ko ñaaka def waye num démé la démé té ñun ñep xam nañ la naka la démé so ñun pour ñu make sure né loolu continue wut pour ñu make sure né amaat nañ gambia bi nga xamné mom la suñu baye bëggon ñu am mom la suñu mami bëggon suñu baye am ak mom lañ bëggon ñun suñu doomi am ñu nekk gambia té mëna vote ñi nga xamné ñu ngi soga vote suñu baye ni suñu oncle ci suñu yaay ak suñu papa ñun leen di ñaan ngir yalla ngeen xamné gambia fu nekk suñu digi la fay la nekk fu nekk yaaya jamé am def na limu wara def te mu ngi def limu wara def mu dina gëna def yi nga xamne mo gëna naxawi ay doomi gambia ndax du fa bëgg joggé ndax yu bon yu def wa ñun ñoo wara xamne lu doy doy na ñi dem december 1st ñu elect adama baro nga xamne mom lañ taana pour mu sauver ñu te inshallah ci yalla andé dina am ba pare ñu boole ci ay ñaan xamne dal ñun ñoko mom te buñ ko defal kenn ñu ko defal ndax a yaakaru keneen joge ci biti ñew dimbele ñu ci gambia bi nga xamne ñoko mom kon ñun ñun suñu bop ñoko wara def fekke mënu lo wax mënu lo bi ndax facebook kenn forcé wala ndax fu nek da nga am sa right ndax gambia fu nek da fa terreur te pare ñep xam nañ naka la fa démé bo waxé rek dinañ la duggal ci problem waye dal li nga mëna def moy nga dem december 1st nga vote votal adama baro nga xamne ñep mom lañ yaakar pour a mu dimbele ñu ñu gëna ci toraange bi nga xamne mom lañ nekk ndax ñu nekk ci biti mëna dellu ci kër suñ xalé mëna demat school di janga mëna ñu bari ñi nga xamne gisatuñ seeni bok té bëgg nañ la na gis na té da fuñ dara da fuñ dara li nga xamne war nañ la mëna tax ñu gëna gambia and on that note i'm appealing again to every gambian that is in the gambian you have your votes do not sell your votes you own your vote and it is your dignity It is the respect that you earn and that you own that people should see. Your vote is your choice and it's your voice. Go out there and vote. Do not sell it for a dime because your dignity cannot be sold. What you what you have in you, the human in you cannot be sold or bought with with whatever amount it is. So your vote is your choice and it's your voice. Please don't sell your votes and go vote Adam Obaro come December 1st for a better and new Gambia. Thank you. And um hello good afternoon to everybody listening. Um I am Mohammed Saleh as my sister rightfully mentioned. Um we are here today to appeal to every Gambian electorate um to vote um for Honorable Adam Obaro come December 1st as he's been selected on um, elected as the coalition leader presidential candidate so i think um it is right to vote for him come December 1st and i am appealing um practically um rightly i am appealing to to my 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 fellow young people especially the teenagers the 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 first time voters um that i would have been part of if i were in the gambia but as you can see and as you all know i have been disenfranchised you know because i am in exile with my family so and i'm i'm not happy for with that um but then i am still appealing to my 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 fellow youth especially those who are 18 19 and above before 25 because those are the age group that have not voted um in the past election that was in 2011 so 
I am appealing to every first time voter to make a right choice. Yes, and the right choice is not voting for Yaya Jame. Because we've been here, and I mean the first time voters. Since we were not born, we have not, we have not seen anything better for us after we were born, after we've gone to school all our our school life, we were just seeing the worst, you know, after, 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 after every election, it's just the worst that we've been seeing. And that is just one reason why we, should, we shouldn't we should vote Yaya Jame into office. And I think the right person we all have to vote for is the coalition candidate, and that is Honorable Adam Abaro. Um, so, for that being the case, I am appealing to every first-time voter, especially um, the, 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 the young the young men the young the young men so because um, I would say this I used to tell my friends you know you have to go vote and most of them will say um, he would still win if you vote um, your your vote is your voice if you do not vote in any election there is nothing you can say if anything goes wrong you cannot talk because you haven't spoken you haven't done what would have made you talk what would have made people know this is what this is against your will because if something is against your will i think when it, if it's political you need to do anything with your your vote yeah so i am appealing to every gambian especially the youth and also to the to the elderly people you've seen more than we have seen you've know you know that it is it hasn't been going right all the time since you you or you you've had your children and you've lived the first republic and you've seen also what's happening right now in the second republic and it's no better than what has happened in the first republic and it's not even close to that so owing to that fact i am appealing to also the elderly people that have not been making the right choice all the time you know because there have been um about four elections that have passed in on the yaya jame that he has all won okay and so to everybody that have not made a right choice, I think this is the right time. If you say there have not been a right candidate that you should have voted for because there wasn't a coalition, because a lot of people say um, the opposition should come together, and this has not ever been made until this time. And this time, it is all the electorate from all the from political parties have come together. And they have given the electorate no more thing to say. Um, the, the the political parties have not come together. It is all the political parties that have come together. Yes, because they are the political parties we have always known, and now they have all come together, putting all their political differences aside. Um, so that being the case, I think the electorate now owe the the the, the political leaders something also that is to vote in their um, coalition candidate now there is nothing every any gambian can say to the the elect the, the political party leaders because they've all put aside all their political differences and come together they've all come together now to 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 to, to save the gambia to save the gambia from the, the political turmoil that we are going through and i think now it's left to the electorate and I'll say this again I am very very much unhappy for not being part of the first time voters and I will appeal to everybody every young man every young woman especially the first time voters to tell you not to let anybody deceive you you don't sell your dignity with anything not even a mansion and not anything you cannot sell your dignity for anything so for, for 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 that being the case you need to you know make a right choice and we all know if we are really going to be honest to ourselves we all know yeah Jame is not our is not the right person for the gambia because he has always he has always tried deceiving gambians with every 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 possible thing you know here is the vision 2020 was here and that has already been a failure and he said vision 2016 and we all knew that was a failure so let us not let ourselves be deceived one more time you know so and i think for my own sake and for the sake of the efforts of my father i think the gambian electorates owe me this me and my family 
this to vote for the coalition candidate that is Honorable Arma Baro. I think every Gambian owes this as we have lost our father in his I mean in his efforts to make a better Gambia come December first and he has lost his life um, in that process that was on the in the, the, the peaceful demonstration that he was up for and that was also just for electoral reforms and it was all going to be useful if December elections had made a difference and I think that has not still been a failed vision because he's gone um, that, that's very sad and but he has seen still he has his 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 aim has not still been um, has not still passed the, the, the stage of fulfillment. So I am appealing to every Gambian, especially the youth, you know, they, they, there is no government, there is no government that would tell you, the youth, that I have done something for you that would, that would, that would, that would, that would stop you for, from not voting for me, from voting for me and voting for another party, as Yai Jame would say always, I have given the youth this, I have given uh, believe me, he hasn't given the youth anything. If you kill our father, what do you think you have given the youth? If you kill our auntie and you jail our people, and there are no, there are no job opportunities. If we are going to be frank to ourselves, there are really no job opportunities. So I think the youth have all, all, every, every, every reason to, 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 to not vote for Yai Jame and vote for um, Honorable Adam Baru for change. And let's see what a new, a new government will bring for us, you know. So um, I would just say a little in, in Maninka, um, I'm going to go to try let's vote for Ngakatanga, Ngakatriafai, Honorable Adam Baru and Mia Lonko, na opposition party leader, so we have to let ya ya tombon tombon nyam ya lonko atata silo la mo be ya lon um pro aina aina gambia bondi abe min kono katun ko nimba jala be ya lon ko gambia be nyam en amantara bulu kendo kono katun ya ji be mote diamola mote kufola ko min nyanta kelo banko ka amantara keka ya jamen ya fo aba safu ko ngani kele ngani kele but then amanka la ko do ta ka min bondala poso kono this is nyin ner mo jama nyin ka mo jama deceive so there is no way al nyanta kan 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 sindi balia nyari la kare fayo kan bari niaji be amam fenke mole miya lon ko kunte miya lon ka manyana ka niaji be man saki wa man saki mim wila do ko di wolam nyinti yena ay do ko ke mole mol la ko do miya lon ko even hanin ta fon ay nga ku kele nga ku contribute le to 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 the development of the gambia miya lon ko nga ko do ta nga ke je o anything so to anybody, ila karte wole la wole wole la semboti ni manta karte fai bon re karte fai hani atara karte fai o tarafa botala ite fiam fala no kotenge so mbe me ol Daniel minna especially the young people mba fala leko especially mini alongo ni nam first time ti do karte fai la mba fule isa kata ali karte ali ata ali adi arma barola brunga Gambia ken brunga Gambia fisiari ngo jenga jibe mina min fala no kotenge because we have already been failed mbe alon ne saeng. Muslim <laughs> Kaitandi lako mbenga kata nga katefa yi adama baro ye kwa lesa nwa yimintu mwansi zola ya kije praena ayimbondi mbe kole ya minkono. Kwa mi albea lo nyame gambi ya beda menteng abele tinyara ntolbulu fenti jeme ya lonko am abije fondi nkele. So nde mbe diya mwami nkele bi abe vita haka nyom fondi nkele lefongo ya mene ya lonko am abeda menteng but I had in a Mansino ya, the Fintilla, Midam being Comas Lotal and Midam being from Father Silocan, Purkajeco, Yajeme, Batamilla, Am Badimolkangai, Batamilla, Bamalka, Mubule, Jato of Amuble, Kanju of Amuble, Jabolwafi, Woku, Woku Kilimo, Membe Galkan, 
o kodi kilo ngai kate kate jo wala gambian ko fonin ke ngalon ko nanamo ya jeme ka jo wala nin to montano karamu kendol to ba ma bi ya jeme jola anin a anala dimbayal imbe balundila to buka mani poto so to le min damala o jakalo wartal de jakalo wartal en badi mol so de be min falale wolon am na 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 kate ke so wolon kangodi wolon sembodi wolon kudi mi yalon ko wala min bonla be batami ko ya jamme asilata kidi ke so la nyame asilata kate ke so la wol nyame kat ngo ningang hakilo murundi ko madron en kardan tam min tamita a ya jibe ay menken tol famala ay menke a mbarin usenu dabo nyolla anin onkul femi pita su nyol kata ke mesen jamme nyol anin donin donin do hani jandi ngo a ay menke opposition wala so nin a taranu nin a tara ti ka ke ya min fateto a al wok wok ke ya mom futa karte ke so da te wok kala so nin karte wolon semboti wolon kamoti ngana wafi wolon na foreyati wolon kuti me yaron ko wala be adi lam to lat na ta menna oto alin sa kata am december karo min kana ten akili folo be nga finti mo kana mo jibe mo kana am si ka fo ko kom ya jeme be win la hani man kate faya won ten am be nyanta na kata ko wol kelale bo nyanta kelale me yalon ko wala nyanta tolto ya me nyanta tolto nyanta ka wala ke men tuta wo be ala bulle karun ko am na ni ni atran to la kebal wol si finti ye ni ota ya di gambia non la ye la wato ta di gambia non la ye la soso ta ya di gambia ye riso si solta ya di gambia non la to fonni ke to kamu ne batu to kamu ne batu nin sita na dimita nga fo mbita ko masilo ta la eta ye fam fa ko masilo la ani nyessi am ye yaaje me bayla carte ke so la ti aji be am même officialité même même de samba no la eta nyanta wolon na le ya so am nyin ko la adiamo man si ante man kuma jama so to be min fola a na man ke ka fo ko am nyom nyom fo nin ke le mbari gambianol mbari muslimol christianol fem fe yalon ko itam gambia dingol di imu si wo silati am bal dan la ale finti am ali ala cartel am kafunyola ali adi honorable adama barola am december karo tili tili folo la am ati fula njango fem fe yalon ko am ya jamele bondila am ila daban ko kam mem gambia ti a ay finti ndi mbesin na pasol jo nga seya ka dum ko am dula man dia yati ndol be damen teng am nin tol nga silo so non be kare fala am janyame mi yalon ko na na right long ya jame a sis mbulu bari hani wo al tol min be su alla do ko lo alla do ko la entor bala la nyaaw nyaal tol bi je la la carte ke sol ala ta al ya di honorable adam barola mi yalon ko ke bal be am ibe da portale ibe sontale nu ya 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 ibe ya elek ya 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 select silo la mi yalon ko am wala nyanta mo be alon ko kom wala silo di dal ya je me bijele akam aka ka fraud leke aka kusi bal be leke pom ka mek so ko abe carte abe abe na abe na election non di la nyame ka na son wala ma na carte ta nga di am opposition coalition wala december 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 force ya ndeng wala so to ka fo da a baraka once again <clears throat> um like I, i said earlier we are appealing to every gambian to still listen to the sending family at least we want to play our part we want to say what we have to say we want to say that we are denied the opportunity to do what we would have we would have done when we were in gambia because we were never in support of a wrong thing our father never taught us to support what is not right <clears throat> that is why he got up and fought for what is not right. He wanted justice for everyone and then this is what we are upholding. <clears throat> we have seen the comments. Many people are sad but you don't need to be sad because wallahi we are doing okay. We even in Allah we we will be fine and we just want the Gambians to vote. That is how you will show us that you really feel our pain. And right now what I tell people is that it's not about us who have already gone through this. We have gone through it, but my my worry is I don't want any other family to go through what my family has gone through. That is only being Gambian. 
that is only being the person that I, 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 I have been raised to be, the person that my father had, had taught me to be, that you care about people sometimes even more than you care about your own self. So Gambia, why we are doing this is because we don't want any other person to go through this. We do not. Because if you go through what we have gone through, when it was sad, it was bad, but then with the strength and with the help of Allah, we made it and we are all fine. But would anybody else be fine after it? How many more people will go to jail? How many more people will just walk in the streets and be beaten with buttons and tear gases? And how many more April 14th and 16th and May 9th will happen in the Gambia if we elect Yahya Jame again? Let's just vote for Adam Abaro on December 1st. And I think this is all we had to do, the best that we had to do. And we will continue standing up for Gambia. We will continue playing our part. And playing like the little role that we have. We just love the Gambia and this is the list that somebody who loves the Gambia would do. So we, we are saying thank you for watching and commenting and spread the news to anybody who has not watched us. You don't need to sell your votes, like I said, it's your dignity and your dignity wouldn't be bought with anything. Nothing worth it. I would have voted and my family would have voted. But because we are here, we wouldn't vote. You vote and make us proud and make us be grateful having Gambian families like you. So we say assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. We look forward to winning come December 1st. And we see you all soon, inshallah.